there's a there's a huge misconception I think about Christianity, um, and you know some people can think we're just sort of you know do gooders and things like this and and just we're goody two shoes and we're all just trying to you know earn brownie points and things like that. But but one thing I think even Christians don't understand is the the endurance of true love. Um, God shows us such love and true love it is, is so enduring. It is so patient. It is so kind and long suffering. Um, it, it endures such pain and hardship. Um, and then God shows again God shows his love for us in that he sent his son to die for us um you know so this this biblical sense of love the 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 love of christ is beyond measure it endures everything um and it shows us that that true love is not what you see in the movies it's it's not this um this sort of fairy tale um happily live happily ever after kind of love you know when we look at the the love of christ we see god's love poured out for us in 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 through his son Mm -hmm. so much so that 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 love meant that jesus laid down his life for us Mm -hmm. i mean you you can't for, for me, you know, you cannot get a more um, sign of endurance, I suppose. You know, there's, there's, there's nothing out there um, compared to Jesus, that he was willing to endure the, the shame of the cross. You know, he was willing to endure the ridicule, the ridicule um, and the shame and the beatings um and the mockery um of death you know and death on the cross but he did it for the joy that was set before him because he knew that he would be in his father's presence once again and 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 with his focus set on that he was able to do it he was able to endure he was able to go through um and it's the same for us if we focus on Christ, if we keep our eyes fixed on the cross where Christ died for us, if we keep our eyes fixed on the resurrection hope that we have through Christ, we will be able to endure. We will, you know, God will pour out his Holy Spirit to help us, um, to strengthen us, to to endure to the end. Um, so, so, yeah. yeah. No, I mean, that's what Hebrews 12 says. You know, consider him, consider Jesus, who went through all that he did. He, I mean, he, like what you're saying, he's our definition of endurance. And endurance is never apart from love. It always, it always is for the sake of love. Love is what drives endurance because whatever our goal is, usually that's what we love. If our goal is these things in the world, such as get money or be really successful at our job, or it could be relational goals, the purpose behind those is love. We usually love that thing that we want. And when Christ himself is our goal, to to have him, to be near him, to be continually with him in eternity, that's what drives Christians to endure is love. And that's what, that's what causes us to have him be our end goal is because we love him. But it's founded on this truth and reality that he has loved us first. Mm-hmm. That verse, we love because he's first loved us. Yeah. And so that's why we endure 